It's probably the last thing Eric Schneiderman ever envisioned. The attorney general is now looking at a possible uh, criminal investigation. Enveloped in a lurid sex scandal, four women accuse him of subjecting them to non-consensual physical violence during romantic relationships. Attorney General Eric Schneiderman was forced to resign. The legal conundrum is who will handle the probe. Manhattan District Attorney Cy Vance said he's already opened a case, but Governor Cuomo raised questions about whether that's appropriate. I want to make sure that there is no question that the district attorney who was investigating is wholly impartial. Cuomo pointing out that when the Schneiderman sex scandal broke, he was investigating why Vance didn't bring sexual harassment charges against Harvey Weinstein. That is a potential complication. I asked the mayor and the police commissioner about that. Are you both comfortable with the fact that the investigation be handled by the Manhattan District Attorney's Office? Yeah, at this time we are. We're comfortable with uh, working with, with Cy's office to investigate these allegations. The Manhattan politicians fall from grace came as two women told the New Yorker magazine they were berated, slapped, and choked by Schneiderman during romantic relationships or encounters. Their injuries, they say, enough for them to later seek medical treatment. According to the publication, Michelle Manning Barish and Tanya Selva Rottenham and two other women say that during their relationships with Schneiderman, he allegedly repeatedly hit them, often after drinking, frequently in bed, and never with their consent. No one is above the law. No one should be afraid to come forward. Shortly after the article was published, Schneiderman denied the assault allegations, saying the relationships were consensual role-playing. He later resigned. Schneiderman, just the latest Randy New York politician to lose his job. LoveGov Elliot Spitzer resigned in a prostitution scandal, and Congressman Anthony Weiner went to jail in a sexting scandal. Schneiderman had been a champion of the Me Too movement, suing Harvey Weinstein for alleged civil rights violations. We have never seen anything as despicable as what we've seen here. Well, the legislature will meet in a special session to fill Schneiderman's expired term. For now, Solicitor General Barbara Underwood will step in as acting attorney general. Now, state Democrats will meet at the end of the month to select a candidate to run in November. Christine.